Hi, it's Megan. I wanted to talk about two of the Original Raw gel creams. And so Original Raw is part of Sammy Co. It's a big Korean uh, corporation. And they have this Original Raw, Raw plus a few other skincare lines with Original Raw being one of my, I don't know, favorite skincare lines. It's got really incredible quality ingredients and consistency across the line. And like a lot of the Korean brands that I favor, they're mixing a, a kind of solid, great science with some really traditional and amazing ingredients. So the first thing I have here is the Black Jam. So the Black Jam and the Blue Jam are two of their kind of cornerstone marquee products. The Blue Jam was the original of the two, and it is known to be really popular among celebrities and whatever else. So if you've never seen a gel cream before, so I showed you, I don't know if I showed you the packaging. This is it. And so with a gel cream, these hold moisture better than most traditional cream style creams, but they're a little bit lighter and they're not going to be quite as clogging or cloying as the creams that I sort of got used to here in the West. And I prefer some of these lighter creams, honestly, on, especially since, like I said, they're holding moisture a lot better than our more cloying, heavy, sometimes clogging creams. So this is what it looks like. And I'll get into the ingredients in a minute, but it feels like almost set jello. And you're, I have the, I'm not actually going to show the blue cream too because you can't really see it when it's just, it's on the finger basically clear. And so the blue jam is exactly the same, it's just blue. When you put it on, it's just a really light, it feels like, I don't know, it feels like a not completely set jello, but then it absorbs very quickly into your skin, and then you can put your makeup or whatever else, or you can also use it in the evening. And where I think they're especially amazing is daytime, when you're gonna put um, your makeup on top of it, and then also I think when you're in humid or hot weather, because then you don't have that like kind of, I don't know, sometimes, my creams, you put the foundation over them or the BB cream or whatever, you get that kind of icky, sticky kind of ugh, thing going on. You don't get that with these. So for the black jam, the description says, this cream gently increases, greatly increases moisture levels in skin. It contains hyaluronic acid, which adds moisture and elasticity to skin, along with volupholine, which is used in chest and hip surgery for volume. It contains over 100 types of natural moisture elements, including 40 natural black ingredient extracts in a gel cream. So black extracts are things like black sesame, black bean, black currant, black tea, and the skin stays moisturized after 40 hours. When I look at the ingredients for this and the Blue Jam too, I mean it's 100 plus natural ingredients, it's really impossible to focus on all the healing ingredients and there are, there are this is not 100% natural. There are some things like, you know, preservatives and whatnot to make sure it doesn't go bad, but it has caffeine, it has black tea, it has kelp, it has sesame, black currant, blackberry, um, garlic, oat, blueberries, salmon eggs, spinach, tomato, safflower, eggplant, cocoa, mushroom, grape, uh, all kinds of seeds and fruits and mango and banana and sugar maple. And I'm reading some of these. It's at witch hazel. It's also got donkey milk and coconut. And the thing about a lot of these natural ingredients is like you can read this whole list and say, oh my gosh, that's like my diet for the next year. But a lot of them targeted, they're really healing things like the breakdown of your skin tone, um, unevenness, discoloration, they're adding antioxidants, they're very anti-aging. And I've started really believing strongly that there are two different kind of schools of skincare in the West. One is just really into the HAs, the BHAs, the stripping, the peels, and then there's one which is going back to kind of what the Koreans have been doing, which is mixing some of these kind of better scientific ideas, but being gentler on the skin and really healing it with natural ingredients. And I'm kind of going honestly to that second um, class of people. And so skin creams like this that are actually providing all this nutrition into my skin and making it look radiant and amazing tend to be my kind of sweet spot right now. 
So blue jam. So the blue jam looks exactly the same, but it's blue, but it's slightly different. And so this one, again, the black jam is slightly more hydrating, like for aging skin. The blue jam is a little bit more kind of across the board, both for oily and aging and, and everything else. Um, and it's blue and uh, really great for oily skin or really warm temperatures. So according to Original Raw, this 10-in-1 multifunctional cream cools, brightens, fight, fights wrinkles, cuts down bloat, lifts, tightens pores, moisturizes, adds nutrition, and increases skin volume, which is fighting that kind of dehydrated look. And that's one of the things I've actually gotten more conscious um, as I've worked with a lot of these Korean brands is just seeing how there is that kind of intense moisture that you can get retained into the skin using some of these products. That's kind of the biggest thing I've seen directly. That and the radiance, that glow. So with the Blue Jam, moisture is sealed in skin for 100 hours using 30 ingredients derived from natural marine sources. So marine sources are going to be very mineral intense. And it's also a gel cream. And so this one, you have some of the same uh, vegetables. You have eggplant. And it also has some really kind of fun things like turmeric, which is incredibly popular in India for really getting rid of discoloration and healing scarring. Uh, henna, basil, so many flowers, I can't even read through all of them. I mean, I have this list in front of me. Pumpkin, uh, another one that's really healing and evening out the skin tone and fighting discoloration. Sea whip. Um, Anyway, all the uh, ingredients, so you can go through every single one of them, are on the Essential Beauty website. And I'll put a link to that and to this, these products in the description to this video. But just to sum it up, I think the Blue Jam is better as kind of an all-around, depending on your skin type. Uh, if you don't want that kind of clogged feeling in your skin and you also want really that healing and the radiance and then I think the black jam is better if you're starting to age a little bit and you want to even hold more moisture and bring in some of those kind of black ingredients which are fighting kind of carcinogens and discoloration and whatnot on your skin so I'm gonna end this video I had actually shot this video before so this is gonna be the second version that goes up but unfortunately I started having problems with my microphone and it just didn't upload correctly. So I'm reshooting it and um, hopefully this one works out better. But thanks very much. I would love to get comments, feedbacks, or suggestions and subscribe on YouTube because that does help me. Thank you.